We have seen how to make a pentagon with this simple strip of paper by just tying a knot. And now we are going to see how to make a 7 sided or a 9 sided or an 11 sided any odd sided polygon with just this strip of paper. And we are also going to understand the maths behind it. First take a parallel strip of paper and tie a knot. Now if we pull both the ends of the strip we get a pentagon. But to make a 7 sided polygon we will have to tie 2 knots. So after one knot leave one end shorter and take the longer end from below towards the shorter end. Now weave the end back onto the other side from inside of a circle pulling it out from where you started exactly. Be careful to weave exactly as shown. Now the two ends of the strip are on different sides and when you pull them there is no slack left in the strip and the whole thing becomes flat and if you count the sides you have seven sided polygon. When you open these you will see six inverted trapeziums back to back and the angle of this trapezium is 2 times 360 by 7 which is 102. Of course the other angle will be 78 and you can see how you can fold the trapeziums back to make this septagon. And now to make a 9 sided polygon you will need a longer strip and 3 knots which need to be woven in a similar manner just like we made the 7 sided polygon. So take the first end back, pull it from where you started as shown here. This is the second knot and then pull it again from the bottom and then weave it back from where you started just as shown here to tie the third knot. And when you pull both the ends leaving no slack you will get a 9 sided polygon. And when you open it you will see 8 inverted trapeziums with the angle of 2 times 360 by 9 which is 80 and 100 degrees. And in this manner you can make any odd sided polygon by tying the knots in a strip of paper. So if you tie 4 knots you get 11 sided polygon. So I hope you enjoyed making the odd sided polygons by tying a knot or even by making appropriate trapeziums with the exact angle. The knotty strip polygon. Thank you.